The North Carolina Arts Council Artist Fellowship Exhibition is a juried exhibition that is presented every two years. Uh, the winners of this year's uh, fellowships are 18 artists uh, who reside in North Carolina and who represent really the best of what is taking place in the state. Uh, they work in a wide variety of mediums. Uh, this exhibition is kind of exceptional in the fact that we have uh, over six, six photographers actually out of the 18 artists and two filmmakers. Uh, but it is just a, uh, an exhibition that represents really the best of what's being done in North Carolina. The wonderful thing about this fellowship, it gave me the opportunity to... Um, actually, I went to China for two months and I did three bodies of work. And what you see here is the one body. But very often in situations like this, it's like, well, what's going to happen after you get it? Well, so far, I've just come back from Abu Dhabi, United Arab Emirates, where I built a 20-foot stainless steel piece for them, which came from one of the three of the series that I did from this grant. Yeah? The other two from that is I've just been invited to the Cairo Biennale which will be in December. And as of last week, I just found out, um, because of my stay in China, I've been invited for the Beijing International Biennale. So, uh, you know, with this, with this grant, this fellowship, all of these things have happened. Um, the fellowship has been invaluable to me because I received it at a time when I was really beginning to get some momentum in my work and so I used the fellowship to hire one assistant to help me and so I was able to be twice as productive as I normally am. I've been a darkroom photographer for over 30 years and I was really interested in moving away from the chemicals and so when I applied for the grant I was applying for the opportunity to be able to move out of the darkroom and create a digital lightroom. The fellowship program is really just a wonderful part of living in this state to know that artists are supported and that they do have these sort of avenues for recognition. As a university teacher, we're often encouraged to teach summer classes, but having the grant, I didn't have to teach a summer class, and so um, it's a gift of time. And it's been really valuable. I've been a documentary photographer for 21 years, and with the North Carolina Artist Grant, I was able to buy new equipment and put myself on the path of digital photography. I have a film in this show and I am not a film artist. This is a new uh, medium for me. Generally I'm a sculptor. I work uh, in still and kinetic sculpture and decided to use the medium of film for the grant that I received from the North Carolina Arts Council. My original proposal was to produce a small monograph of photogravures. And um, so uh, these are small editions, 25 in each of each print. Having the uh, fellowship really allowed me to explore some new techniques using molds to blow glass into so that you can really get fingerprint detail that allows you to, you know, say exactly what you want to say. The fellowship sort of put me out there and um, now that I look around the gallery I see I truly represented with the best today. So it gave me a kind of confidence. When I d decided that I wanted to actually photograph the Lower Ninth Ward, I also realized that I needed to do it over the course of a year. It was a very expensive project. Without the grant, uh, I, I would have been in some kind of trouble. The fellowship, it meant a lot to me. First time to build my studio in my 20 years, I work large scale, have no studio, working in my living room all the time. So the, finally, the fun helped a little bit, but it actually I have a space of my own right now. Uh, the fellowship was so such a gift for me um, because it allowed me to build a studio at my house. These pictures are, are part of an ongoing project uh, to photograph my home, North Carolina. Uh, the fellowship has literally allowed me to expand my horizons in terms of this project, in terms of where I'm able to go, 
uh, what I'm able to do. Uh, it's provided uh, materials and supplies, as well as motivation to continue, honestly.